So today's a home day, finally! <laughs> so I promised Karis we're gonna have a movie day. We're about to pop some popcorn. Yeah. Let's do this. Pop. Put it inside the microwave. Like this? Yep, put it down. It says this side up. What does it say though? One and a half to two and a half minutes on high. I'm just gonna do it for 140 just in case because we don't want it to burn. Let's close the microwave first. Please. <laughs> Push. And then, nope. We're gonna do it manually. So you wanna turn it till it says 140. Oh, then we go back. Go back a little bit more. One more. There. Oh. Boop, boop. And then press start. Push it hard. Push. There you go. And it's gonna pop. popcorn for now. Who's all comfy cozy over there? Oh, lovely daddy. <laughs> Are you napping right now? Is it yummy? Yeah. Mm. Hey, daddy. Who woke up for popcorn? <laughs> Somebody woke up for popcorn. <laughs> she smelt it and saw it, and now like, I'm going up. Yeah. We're watching Home Alone. Is this the number one? Mm -hmm. Number one on Disney Plus right now, right? Mm -hmm. Disney Plus. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I'm like, which movie do you want to watch, Karis? I'm like, you want to try watching Home Alone? Because it's one of mo uh, mommy and daddy's favorite Christmas movies ever. And Karis is like, I don't want to watch this. It's not a kid movie. But mommy and daddy are like, just watch. It's really good. It is made for kids as well because there's lots of kids in it. Yummy? Aw. Mm. <laughs> Ooh, that one's extra buttery. Mmm, yummy. Mm. Yummy, baby? Mommy keeps shoving him more and more. You guys love Home Alone like I do. What is your favorite part of the movie? My favorite part is when the whole family is like late and they're like running through the airport. That's like the most like just like whoa. <laughs> when, when the boy said Mama Dammy. Oh, no. He was in big trouble after he said that. Here, so I can be doing like the white ones. So now we're giving all the white ones to daddy and you're eating all the yellow ones? Mm -hmm. <laughs> white one? Oh, no, daddy wants the yellow one. Mm. Daddy wants the yellow one. <laughs> <laughs> I can't have the buttery popcorn. Couldn't get any I only get the white ones? Oh. Which one was that one? White. Hey, yeah, no way. Yellow. I want yellow. What? Yellow. I like the yellow one. I do too. I like Forgot to turn on the Christmas tree. What? Where is this? Little, little. Yeah, there it is. Ah, much better. are both napping right now. Alan's in at the kitchen getting dinner ready or we're gonna have like a late lunch early dinner. Um, but yeah we're eating hot pot 
tonight, which I'm pretty excited about because we haven't had hot pot at home for a while. It's a perfect day because it's kind of like cloudy and rainy outside. But yeah, the girls are napping and uh, London slept like half through half the movie. She woke up at the end and watched the ending. And then Karis, I asked her at the end, I'm like, do you like Home Alone now? Because she was kind of iffy at the beginning because she thought it was just like an adult show. And then she's like, yeah, I really, really like it. Um, their whole family came home at the end. And she was so happy. <laughs> and I'm like, would you, would you want to watch it again? And she's like, yes. So I'm happy that she liked it. London is a little bit too young to understand right now. But when she's a little bit older, we'll watch Home Alone again with her. But I believe there's like, I think Home Alone. I know there's Home Alone 1 and 2. I'm not too sure about how many they ended up making. But, you know, the one with, uh, what's his name again? M Baby, what's, what's Kevin's name again? Friday? His real name. Is it McLaughlin? Do you remember? Yes. So what's Kevin's name again? His real name? Kevin who? The, the Home Alone kid. Oh, Macaulay Culkin. Macaulay Culkin. Yeah, there. Yeah, I think there's like two Home Alone, so maybe we'll end up watching Home Alone 2 one of these days with Karis as well since she enjoyed Home Alone 1. Yeah, I'm just folding laundry right now. The cope, like a huge mountain of laundry. Felt so nice watching a movie earlier, just chilling and relaxing. We haven't done that in a very, very long time because we're always out and about, going here, going there, different classes and everything, so it's really nice. A little nice break. <laughs> things ready to go. We have, what do we have? Quail eggs, yam noodle bundles, and then we're gonna try this one. We actually got this from TNT. It's the Hattie Lau Hot Pot Seasoning and Soup Base. First time ever trying it, so we'll see. We usually use the, uh, was it Kiko Men? Mm -hmm. Kiko Men, like hot pot broth that's in the bottle, mm -hmm. um, but or we don't. Pepper. Yeah, or satay. We didn't have it today, but we have this. So we're going to try this, and if all else fails, we're going to do chicken broth and satay soup base. But we're going to try that. Excited to try. This is like a famous hot pot place, so there you go. Then Alan has his frozen tofu. What he does is he takes like a block of, is it firm? Yeah, firm? medium or firm. Medium or firm tofu. Stick it in the freezer for like a while. <laughs> what would you say? Like a like, month? A month ish? Even a couple of weeks. Or a couple of weeks, and it turns into this little, little, I don't know, how would you even call this? It looks like a, I don't even know. That's sponge. what it looks like. Yeah, a little sponge so it can soak up all the soup. Enoki, washing or rinsing away. Um, this is one of Alan's favorite as well bean curd sticks that he soaks to make it nice and soft. We're gonna wash this after. Bok choy. And then Alan's gonna make his. Delicious, delicious. One of my favorite hot pot dipping sauce. And we actually have, he actually filmed a video on this, on this channel, I believe. If you guys haven't watched it yet and you wanna know um, how to cook it, I'll leave the video down below in the description box. You guys can check that out. But we have here some peppers, uh, ginger, garlic, shallots, green onion, cilantro. It smells so good already, he didn't even make it. And then he puts uh, soy sauce as well. You're gonna wash and chop these mushrooms up. And all we have left is some wonton noodles for Alan in the fridge. We're gonna ask Karis and London if they wanna eat udon. We'll take that out as well. And then slice up the beef. We got a few fish balls and then we're good to go. Let's get this guy out. All set, ready for the food. I'm getting hungry. Pretty soon, Hank. I wanna show you guys what the, the soup base looks like. It's the powder pack. Don't know what's in there. Alan said maybe chicken broth. <laughs> yeah, chicken broth powder. Yeah, and then this is like dates and goji berries. <laughs> Look who's up from their nap. How come you didn't say hi to daddy? You playing with him? No. No? No play. 
just tried at the hot pot soup base. It's actually pretty good. It, it brings me back to the time when Al and I traveled to Taiwan and had their hot pot. But in Taiwan, they have like all the, um, what is it, little spices, almost like Szechuan kind of, but not, not too spicy. But yeah, in Taiwan, we had like the hot pot, it was like red, but it kind of has that similar taste. It's like more of like a chickeny, herbal sort of taste. I actually really like it. Hopefully the kitties like it. If not, we'll mask it with Alan's dipping sauce. <laughs> this is definitely hitting my hot pot cravings. Mm -hmm. <laughs> not your tissue. <laughs> 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 That soup is really good. If you guys like chicken herbal taste, highly recommend. <laughs> hey, Missy. <laughs> Veg. I don't know. So when we're in Taiwan, when Elle and I went to go eat hot pot, we asked for dipping sauce because we're so used to eating hot pot with dipping sauce, and the waitress there said, no, you don't need dipping sauce for our soup base. It's very flavorful already. And not only that, she refused to give us dipping sauce. Mm -hmm. She's like, if, if, you, if you insist on asking us for dipping sauce, I'm actually going to be offended. I was like, she's like, that's how good our soup base is. Uh -huh. But she goes, try it first. And if you really, really, really need dipping sauce, I will bring it to you. Yeah. And then we tried it. She came back like five him and She's like, so how would Pop pop, do you need the pink sauce? Look, you are right. This thing is so good. You uh -huh. don't need the pink sauce. It was so good. And same here. Sorry, babe. I'm abandoning your dipping sauce today. <laughs> bye bye. He cares. Which one do you want? What would you like? This one? Ooh, you get the last one. There you go. What do you say? Thank you. You're welcome. She's having that one right there. This is like one of my favorite popsicles. Oh, dude, did you get to the condensed milk? <laughs> Hi, baby. Yummy. Yeah, 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 be careful, my drip. What? My drip. Be careful. This is my favorite part of this, the top, because it's full of. You guys can see the discoloration. The top is full of condensed milk. <laughs> Mm. And then when you finish the condensed milk, it goes into this icy matcha green tea with red beans. So the other day when I was at my parents' place, we went to over to the dollar store and I found this cute little Barbie paint book that had like little paint things in it with paintbrush. I didn't end up getting it because it was a little bit more pricier than a dollar, which I kind of regret. <laughs> Because you know, when you're at the dollar store, you expect to pay like a dollar, a dollar fifty, and it was like two or three dollars. I'm like, no way! But then I ended up going back, <laughs> couldn't find that same book, but we got these little books. Ooh. Yeah, so pretty. And it's like, I know, you're gonna be Elsa for next Halloween? Yeah. That's right. So they look like this. So they come in this little booklet. And I was expecting dollar store to be, you know, like these little um, paint. I was expecting it to be very, very light. Like you could barely see the color, but man, these are pretty good. So they come in 12 sheets. Of course, she got frozen and a princess one. And then you basically take Q-tip or a paintbrush with water. You dip it and then you take a little bit of that and then just paint it. And it's pretty vibrant, the color. And Karis has been obsessed with doing this. <laughs> She's almost finished the whole book, so I have to go back and get some more. But yeah, it's pretty cool. And then you just rip it out, and I'll show you guys what she's done so far. Look how cute. It's like so vibrant and pretty. I would have loved this when I was a little kid. This would make such a cute like stocking stuffer, or even like, you know, when the kids have birthday parties. And I basically put like this little kind of cardboard thick not even waterproof, it's like kind of smooth underneath because if she dipped too much water, it could leak through.
So we're going out in our PJs. <laughs> mommy Aki. Yo, Mommy Aki. London Aki. London Aki. Daddy Aki. Aki. Aki, yeah. I hear daddy running down the stairs. So we're gonna head to Walmart because the puff pastry is on sale this week. I'm gonna grab a few before puff it all sells out Aki. for Christmas. Because you guys know during Christmas time, puff pastry is like puff pastry. Aki, Aki. So I'm making Alan go to Walmart and he's not happy about it. <laughs> puff pastry, Aki, Aki. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Just kidding, Alan's always happy to be with Linda, yeah. right? Yes, I love it. <laughs> He's like, I would have rather stayed home, but I'm like, you know what, let's go out. We've been home all day, get a little bit of fresh air. The girls get to go out. Do you guys want to stay home or go out? Out. Out? Out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you have a new car seat. <laughs> Is it so big and comfy cozy so you don't get so stuck and stiff in your other old seat belt? Ooh, do you like that? Does it look more comfortable? Whoa. Put your head against this. Let's see if it's tall enough. Yeah, it's perfect. Wow. What do you say to Daddy? Thank you. You're welcome. And look, this goes under here. You use an adult seat belt like Mommy and Daddy. I use an adult seat belt. I like you. Can you get it, babe? And then, yep, it's... Not right there. Where is it? I, I feel it. <laughs> There we go. <gasps> wow! And look, girls, your frozen cup, cup. You have a cup holder and a little snack holder. Isn't that cool? Yeah. Do you feel better in this one now? Yeah. Not as stuck? Yeah. Yeah. Like than your old one? Yeah. Yay. Thank you. You're welcome. Check it out. <laughs> Ooh, who's drinking water in their new car seat? <laughs> who's smiling from ear to ear? She's so happy. Right. Let's see if these things fit here. So What's that? Is that for our old one? Yeah. Until the new ones come in? Yeah. Oh, they do fit. <laughs> That's a little, uh, yeah. like, you know, so this doesn't, because you know how the adult seat belts are a little stiff? This one makes it nice and soft. So if you ever fall asleep on it, What did you say again? You're like, oh, let's go in the morning tomorrow. And I'm like, no, let's go now before they sell out. <laughs> and they were sold out, but nobody's restocking at this hour. So we're going to have to go tomorrow again. <laughs> Here you go, Daddy. Here you go, Daddy. Hey.